Well, testimony took up much of the day in the trial of Port Arthur teacher Ruby Gunner. She's accused of pushing, hitting, and choking a student last April. At the time, Gunner maintained her actions were in self-defense. Justin Hinton is covering the trial and joins us live now from the Jefferson County Courthouse with more. Justin? Greg, the trial has wrapped up for the day, but it is not over. Jurors will be back tomorrow morning at 10 for day two of testimony. Now today, jurors heard from a number of witnesses, including the student claiming the assault, another teacher who witnessed it, and other school employees. The student said there were two fights. In the first, he says he was trying to go outside, but Gunner blocked the door. On his third attempt, he says she punched him, knocking him to the ground. He says he kicked her in the leg before going to the office. Now, a second confrontation occurred later that day in his next class, and jurors heard some of the most dramatic testimony of the day from the teacher in that classroom, Trudy Goza. She says she did not hear an exchange of words between the student and Gunner, but she says Gunner followed the student into the classroom, started wrestling with him, and said, quote, desk started flying. Goza also said the two pushed each other and eventually Gunner ended up on top of the student. At the time, he was 11 years old. Now Goza testified she could hear him gasping that Gunner was killing him and you could hear her voice breaking as she explained what she saw and heard. Now when asked by the state who won the fight, she said Miss Gunner. Later that day, or not that day, but later today, excuse me, and an attendance clerk also testified. She said that when she walked into the room, she could see that Gunner was on top of the student, that she had him pinned down, but she could not tell where her hands were, whether or not she was choking the student. She said, though, that one of those hands was on his leg. Again, the trial will continue tomorrow at 10, and we will have the latest for you at that time. We are live in Beaumont tonight. I'm Justin Hinton, KFDM 6 News.